All right, do I want to go to the place of ice? Being all ice laden as I am. Um, I don't know. Let's go to the... Go here. It is in our fight, indeed. Uh, this looks nice. <laughs> See that? Can the disposal unit destroy all mountains? Wow. Can this acid launcher while it dissolves Vec hives infesting the mountains? Oh, so can this guy destroy the mountain? Not done this one before. Oh! So. When I deploy, deploy anywhere on the map damaging adjacent enemies, so... Oh, it's a shame. <laughs> That's pretty cool, though. Um, how are you going to destroy mountains, though? Yeah, I know, right? It's, this guy there can only do damage, but if this if this does something... Is, oh, oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, maybe this guy will help out. How are you going to do? <laughs> How are you going to destroy the mountains? Do damage to mountains. This man speaks sense. Ah, oh, if this guy wasn't wasn't armored, this would have been such a cool entrance. So, can you shoot anywhere on the map? Oh, you can. I just want my guy to move, which... Oh, I can do this, can't I? I can jump out of the way. So I guess I can hit this guy. Or give me a shield so I can take this hit. I can then come up here and block this. Shoot, oh no, shoot him into this. I could just freeze this dude, couldn't I? Actually, yeah, that's sufficient, isn't it? Let's do that. Oh, no, 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 because he's... He wouldn't do one damage to this guy, isn't he? Oh, the, the attack gets cancelled. I keep forgetting if, if someone gets frozen, the attack gets cancelled. Um, and then you are... You're punching... I guess. Then you are destroying these mountains. Nice. My shield has failed, its systems will be disciplined. Okay. Again, I could come here and freeze this guy and then shoot, doing one damage to him, killing this dude. Um, I guess I could then acid this guy and push this guy. Because then the acid can still take out these mountains in one turn, so... That here, here, here... You can acid this. There's a lot of acid on the map. Not touch that. Presumably my sh oh nice. Presumably my shield stays on me as I move around. But here, kill this dude. Then come here and freeze him. Oh, I, yeah. 
So here and then kill this dude. Here and freeze him. And then you can come round and whack this guy. He will shoot his friend and the rest of the my, uh, rest of the mountains can be acided. So God, the map looks so different without all the mountains. Oh, one turn. Oh, I should get some experience for my guys, right? If I could jump there. Pushing him this way. Wouldn't get any kill on him though. Is there any way to get a kill on him? I don't think so. I get a kill on him. No. Um, and you can prepare for some reason. Oh, I could have acided, obviously. That's fine. Extra experience that way. But this is fine. This is good. Mission was a success. The acid launcher is intact and the vet have disintegrated. Lovely. Yes. My threat detective, or when the power plants kill at least seven enemies. Well, for the sake of power, let's do it. Critical against the vet commander if we lose, we may lose it twice as well. Excellent. Um, oh, I can only hit one person. Well, I can kill this one guy. And then you can go here and you can go... Ooh. I guess swipe at him, shoot at him, freeze him. There a way for me to get the freeze in a way that I can then be shot out of it. That might be a better alternative, because I can take mech damage again now, now that I've got the achievement. So go here. Freeze this dude. Or do I even really want to freeze him? Just push at this guy. Uh. Oh, I didn't even take damage because I've got a shield, of course. Oh, actually. I could freeze a city, couldn't I? That would be cool. Pretty cool, actually. Oh, it freezes me, though, obviously. I thought about that. Just attacking one, that's fine. Seven enemies, okay, I'll kill him. I guess I need to come and switch him round. Uh, shoot him and then just leave it at that. Not really a lot else I can do. Get 
okay, I'm frozen by him. Hmm, a lot of enemies on the screen. Also got to try and remember or try and get the three kills with one shot of the Janus cannon. What are you attacking us to? There's one, two, three, four threat. I kind of feel like I have to freeze this guy. I don't think there's anything else I can do. I can come round here, freeze him, and then shoot. Yeah, move and then shoot. Oh, though he could land in acid. I guess that's not the end of the world. Shoot to free him from ice, killing this dude, and then it would then hit him, unfreezing him, but his attack would be cancelled. I'd have moved out of the way of this, and then I've got to somehow block these two attacks with this one guy. Which I don't think I can do. So, should we go down to one power grid? I mean, it. Assuming we defend both the power plants, we get two back. There'll be a net gain of one. They go here, freeze him, push these guys, and then go and kill this dude. His attack was cancelled, right? Yeah, cool. All right, down to one. You mean doesn't defend? <laughs> God, this uh, this particular timeline has been a travesty for casualties, killing everyone left, right, and centre. Um, kill five. Oh, can I kill two enemies in this turn? Is that even doable at this point? I guess I can push him into acid to get one kill. But that's still only one kill. Oh! Nope, they're not sufficient. I could go here and jump this guy into the acid. So I could do this, which would do one damage to him, and then I could shoot with this guy. So that would kill him, but it still wouldn't kill this guy. I feel like this run is not going to last very long. Well, it was only going to be a two island run, which is one of the reasons why I'm being a little bit more complacent about the whole thing. So once we finish this island, then we're going straight to the to the end. Let's at least get a kill. How was I going to get a kill? I guess I'm going to go going to go here, do what I just did then, and then do this. Can't get the flies to attack each other, not easily. Yeah, shame. Yeah, hopefully we'll pick this up. I'm pretty sure we do. That one bit of reputation would be nice. Never have too much reputation. Bad times. Yeah, I do get the time pod. Oh, it's you. In plus three move on first turn of every mission, indeed. Plus one mech reactor, that's also kind of nice. Cool. Um, and... I guess nano silos. High threat, excellent. And the train, oh, good old train mission. 
I guess it'd be here than the heap. Ooh, conveyor belts. Block vet spawning three times. Let's do the nano silos first and then the heap. James to provoke the vet with it. Yep, 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 okay, cool. Oh, and this is a shield guy. Oh, you're annoying. It doesn't actually do any damage other than to this dude, so I might as well just put him here, right? Annoying. to be moved. The only person that can move things is you. You're gonna miss, which is fine. So I guess I kill this dude with this dude. Actually I can jump out of this, can't I? No, I need I need to kill this guy so the Janus Cannon can or the, the mirror mech can Push this guy out of the way. And then he's still here though. Annoying. Guess I could just freeze this dude. Can I get shield? Yes, of course. The shield is nice. So, da -ba -da. Uh, um. Yeah, it'd be nice for this guy to be able to do a little bit more than what he's currently doing. I'm kind of obliged to do this, aren't I? Oh, I can get to this side. Uh, not helpful. Freeze the... No, I should keep myself unfrozen just in case. I need to move around next turn. Problem. I like how no one's attacking any critical structures. Well, I guess the train is kind of critical, but who's going first? I guess I can freeze. Uh, oh no! How do I take this guy out? Come around with this dude. I can't stand here and shoot this. I guess I could freeze the city first, then he'd get shot and die. I can't shoot him from the bottom because it'd slide him up into the train. I guess I could freeze him. Cancel the attack. Yeah, freeze him. And then shoot him to unfreeze him, and then he can just attack the Scion. Take this damage because it's not a problem. do that um and what are you attacking here hmm can you get to? You can freeze this guy or this guy. I guess you're obliged to freeze this guy. Oh, okay. No, no, we're fine. We're fine. So he can just shoot through him and he can come and punch this guy and they would get experience from it. So 
you freeze him. You do that. And you do that. Nice. Easy snuff. Cool. And then I guess we're doing the heap with conveyor bells and slowly clawing back at our grip power. Know that you and the frozen tides are walls against the Vec. Oh, faith. Back to full power. I know you're just blitzing back up. Oh, uh, dip, 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 dip. um, against this guy, and then you can, I don't know, go here, and you can. I really like this drop in power. It's just not been, not been useful. Okay. So here and punch him, block that spawn, you freeze him and you shoot him. Seems like a turn. Block spec, spec spawning, okay, so this is worth doing. Just stand on here to get all the spawn. Oh god, everyone's spawning. Um, you're going to be pushed this way, so you're going to hit this instead. Under the conveyor belt, the conveyor belt's happened first, right? So I could sit here and push you, and then you will miss. Um, but then you would need to prepare yourself I want to stand here yeah playing this all way too quickly I get pushed and miss right Nice. Oh. Oh, the problem with this little conveyor belt sequence is eventually they'll get thrown into into the city. Um, what are you shooting? You're shooting there. That's awkward. So my dude is kind of obliged to kill him. Oh, actually, this works nicely, doesn't it? Oh, no, I can't freeze him with this guy. Do I need to? Yes, I do. Um, so if I go here and kill this dude, you won't get pushed into the city. I'll get my shield and get pushed back. He'll get pushed over and shoot my shield. So that sorts out this little mess. I then need to worry about this dude. I can't push him back, then he'd hit this city. So I'd need to freeze him. So we could take more grid damage. Thing is, we've been doing that all game. Um, how would this bike guy be used? I can use this guy to punch him, gain the shield, this whole sorts out this little mess. This guy can still come around and shoot this guy up, killing the Vec and cutting this guy. Because this guy's one up, he'll be attacking his friend in this city, and I just freeze the city with this dude. Uh nice. Nice. Cool, and I just need to 
lock the spawn on my last turn, I guess. Oh. How did you manage to break that isolated mountain? Which one? Oh, actually, this is really bad for me. This is one, two, th three. I could take this guy out. You're kind of obliged to shoot one of these two. So I guess you'd want to... If you jump over him... Doesn't kill this guy. He can go and save this dude. How many movements? One, two, three, four. But this city will take damage, and this city will. But there's no way I can free this guy at the same time. This is what you get when you play everything too quickly. No, uh, shooting him would free me. Then I could lose the tank, but then... I'd still take damage here and or here. Actually, I'll take damage in three places. If I go and free this guy... What happens then? You can freeze him, or you can freeze him. Three, one, two, can't even freeze him. Okay, so I think the only thing I can do to save the coal plant, which is kind of what I want to do, because I'm not getting the block, is jump my guy over, that will kill him, he'll take one damage. I can then move this dude out of the way. Shame. At least I get the kill. Yeah, there's nothing else I can do. Hope I survive. Oh, I'm being an idiot. I could have used conveyor belts, possibly. Hmm, sad. This has been a terrible run for casualty loss. Well. Roy the Spied Leader, our sensor picked up a vet we've never encountered. Spirit won't go down easily. Hello, friend. Um. That seems like a good place to go. Get that spider straight away. Oh, what are you doing? Is that all you do? Just spawn spiderling? Okay, take out this guy seems of utmost importance. If I can take him out, take the hicks, I'll have a shield. I could then move him up. Move him to free something. Move him up here, him to freeze this dude. Push him over and freeze him. I'll block two spawns. Let's let's do that. So here, here. Oh, I'm not thinking. Let's reset that. Reset that. Freeze the city at E7 and then use the tank on the purple Vec. Yeah, that's what I'm... That was what I was attempting to do. But I should have moved this guy up and froze him first. And now I can do... Not as much damage, but I'm blocking the spawns. 
probably a bit sketchy still, but let's say I'm sort of sort of blitzing through this run a little bit. These spiders spawning. Wow, okay. Lots of crazy things. I guess shooting here and shooting here is kind of nice. Take a hit from here. You can come up and attack this guy and then you can freeze him. Or maybe... Oh no, I want to destroy this spider leader, don't I? I don't just want to freeze him. What if I jump here? Ooh, no, don't want to destroy the corporate tower. Super cool. Takes out lots of guys, but... Damages the tower. Oh, I guess I could freeze the tower, then jump here. Kill him, 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 and him. You would be free, and then you could move over and attack. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. That looks like fun. Freeze the tower. Jump here. And now you're going to shoot your friend to death. <laughs> Ugh. Spend time to think about these things. It's annoying. Um, I guess I should just move out of the way because I can't shoot him because it'll shoot this. I can't shoot him because it'll shoot this. Uh... So, yeah, that's annoying. Fine, it's a fast run. And we're getting into the practice of speedrunning it, right? So we can go and do that at some point. Um, um... Wow, okay, there's a lot going on. These are not the kinds of levels that you can just <laughs> blitz through, so... I don't think I'm going to be able to kill the spider leader, like... I need to get two hits on him, basically, now. That works. Puts me an inch away from death. But that would kill... Kill him, he would take two damage. How would I stop? Oh no. I couldn't stop this guy and this guy because this dude's frozen. Actually, how do I stop this guy at all? Um, maybe I do need to freeze or unfreeze this guy so. Oh, actually, wait a minute. I can't even shoot this. Because then I shoot my own city. Wow, things are really dire. Things are really dire. Well, <laughs> just take the grid damage. Do what we've been doing all game. And hope that the last turn with hundreds and hundreds of enemies isn't going to be a problem, which it totally is. Um, is there any way I can use this guy to free him? Not really, he's shooting here, shooting here, shooting... I would have to use him to if I wanted to freeze him. So, punch to freeze, unfree this guy. And then you can freeze him, and then you can come around and shoot this dude. And I would just do one red damage to myself. And then there would just be a bazillion enemies on the last turn. I don't know what else I can do. Let's just... Let's just go for it. And hope that we survive. But this run has been super, super complacent. Um, 
And how many enemies? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> wow. If the spider leader stands on acid, I could kill him on the last turn. even run here to jump this side like my movement is so restricted it's difficult to get to anything so okay let's 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 try and think about this I can move my dude out of the way and get a shot here to kill him pushing him into this I won't be able to oh, actually I could Okay, no, we, we might be able to salvage something from this. I could go here and push my dude into this, which would unfreeze me and kill him. I could then freeze this guy, or I could punch this guy or this guy or something. It'd be nice to jump. Actually, if I jumped here, I could get up here to jump here. I could push him into him. Or it'd be nice to jump on an enemy space. Um, looks very difficult to pull off. Yeah, do impacts on the corporate towers, um, the corporate tower damage your grid as well. Um, I don't think I can even jump into that space. But here, and I could get a, at least a kill on this, and then freeze this dude. So I would take one, one grid damage. Assuming it doesn't defend. Be just enough to get through by the absolute skin of my teeth. So push. Yeah, jump here. Just for the extra kill, the extra bit of experience. Then freeze this guy. Let's just let's just go for it. I get the kill game and freeze this guy oh wow craziness what a terrible 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 island terrible run interesting team though but just they seem to restrict themselves a little too much Hey, that's fortunate. <laughs> Crazy. Sad times. Yeah, this has been like all this reputation lost. Uh, well, I guess I'm selling this dude because you're useless to me now. Do I want two reactor cores? Anything else that I could sell? This looks like so much fun. I might get it. They only give me the chance to buy one more power core though. Guess I could sell the hydraulic legs. Uh, let's let's do it. And you can have that, and you definitely need that powered. Unlimited uses! I want unlimited uses for it. Plus one damage. Mm. Movement is something that I'm really restricted by. Should I get on some... Oh, no, I should get double shot. Right. Unlimited uses. 
Oh, it's only if he doesn't move. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to do the double shot. I don't think. Let's. Let's do this. And I guess give. Oh, how long was that sitting there? Give myself one more movement. Yeah, I mean, it's a setup. It's not very good, but it's a setup. 